Hello guys, so uh, to continue on the uh, Vexes group uh, workflow, uh, we will do this. As you can see, this is pretty, pretty nice. Uh, the result is pretty clean. I have something uh, really, 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 really nice. And in fact, this is just a plane. Yeah. So how to do this? I will press H to hide it. I will create a simple plane. I will scale it. And this one, I will press E to extrude. I will select everything and I will create a vertex group and on Companion now there is this that will uh, help you to create vertex group. If I click that will directly create a vertex group and assign the uh, the, uh, the vertex. I will select those two and I will go here and I will change the white and I will assign. I will change it to this and I will assign. Now if I call this solidify I will have this result and here there is the vertex group I will press C and that will take the vertex group in account and if I press X I will be able to change the value. So as you can see this is pretty interesting. Uh, I will move this one a little to have something different. Okay so now I will select uh, those uh, vertex and I will add a bevel on those vertex and I will just move the uh, modifier under the solidify. Like that I will have this result and I will just apply the solidify a little like that. You can see you can do whatever you want. I will select this, I will add a bevel in weight mode on this one. So this is my result right now. I press shift W to add this one and I will change the value because I want something like this. Shift W another time and I will add some subdivisions. So right now we have this. This is just this and this is really nice. I will add a cylinder. I will scale it. I will do something like that. Press G. I will add why not in Y an array. I will duplicate it. But on this one I will remove the array. Okay. So I will select both and move them like that. And I will add my boolean here and I will do, do this and move the boolean under to have this result. And same for this one. No, not this one. Uh, I will select the other one. Yes. It wasn't this one, it was this one, and that's it. So, as you can see, I will hide everything. I have this kind of result. I want to use the uh, URI modifier triangulate only on handguns. I will update it. And now I will add a subsurf like that. So, uh, for this object, I really don't care about uh, the... Um, the the wire because right now it's just for concepting and as you can see there is some uh, some artifact here it's because I need to upla select this one with uh, shift and I will make an auto smooth and now this is okay so I will select this press control that will hide everything so as you can see this is pretty 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 easy and uh, pretty nice this is just that and everything is editable i can uh, change absolutely everything i have my whole hair i can edit this to move it like that i can uh, select the this one to why not add another subdiv another count like that and i can uh, of course uh, hide it and this is the result pretty 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 clean pretty nice you can uh, for example uh, select this i will add uh, why not this or maybe yes i will add this okay so i have this kind of uh, asset i will scale it a little i will move this one here like that i can move it like that press g okay and i can of course edit everything, add another bevel, and why not make a mirror like that, and add a boolean. In this case, I will move it one, uh, two, three, okay, under the uh, two last uh, modifiers, 
and I can now hide this one. So as you can see, you can edit everything, you can do whatever you want, and this is pretty, pretty nice in my opinion. And this is of course just this. If I select this, the result. And it, with um, Yuri's build, the result is perfect. This is uh, this is really nice. I really like it. And this is a really simple piece, but you can go uh, way <laughs> further than that and uh, do whatever you want.